Hello, my name is Tridar, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build a Roman eagle statue in Minecraft. Let's get started. So first, let's take a good look at the eagle statue here. As you can see, it has its wings flayed out on both sides here. We have the beak around this area, and we have some talons down here. And the eagle is, of course, swooping down to pounce upon its prey. Of course, since this is Minecraft and a flying eagle is a very complex statue, I've done the best I can to replicate the general shape. For the details, you pretty much have to use your imagination. But if you stand back a little ways, I think you can indeed see that it is a statue of an eagle. And I'm presenting just the eagle today, but I'm also showing you some options you can use to display it because I assume you're going to want to build the eagle wherever you please in your world and maybe incorporate it into some of your own builds. However, down here, it is also presented on a small pedestal if you want one a little lower in height. But if you want something a little bit more grand on top of the pedestal and in between the eagle statue, you can put a Corinthian column up here with a small entablature that the eagle itself will be sitting on to give you a couple of options to construct a fine Roman monument of your own. Now, the designs for the base and the column here are fairly straightforward. So for the purposes of the tutorial, I'm just gonna give you a good look at it. So all sides are the same here. And this is the same base down here, and this is the Corinthian column design that I always use. And you can make the column drum as tall as you please. This uh, world here will be available for download, by the way, so if you need measurements, you can come here and uh, make them yourself. But we have our upside down stairs here representing our acanthus leaves. And we have a small design up here for an entablature with some dentils and everything. And on top of that is sitting the eagle statue, which I'm going to be showing you how to construct momentarily. But first things first, let us take a look at the bill of materials you will need to construct it. You will need 99 blocks of diorite, 61 blocks of cobblestone, 3 stone bricks, and 16 torches. And you should have no trouble finding any of those materials. And once you have done that, let's take a look at the phases of the tutorial. Because this design is laid out, I'm showing you this eagle in one block slices meaning that each slice I'm going to show you here is going to be one block taller than the previous slice. So let me give you a good top-down view. This is the base. You are using your three blocks of stone bricks down here, by the way, sort of a perch for the eagle to be landing on. And in between here, you have some diorite and some cobblestone done as you see here. Very simple pattern to make there. And on top of that, you then want to come around here and put this on top of that or this phase here. And then let's go to the next phase over here. I'll give you a, a side view around this. And you can see where I'm placing the torches as we go along. They're just done for uh, lighting effects. And a uh, top-down view of that phase. And of the next phase over here, you want to build out of these blocks here, just stacking it on top of the previous phase. And let's take a look at uh, this block section slice here. As you see done here, just replicate the patterns on your screen. And feel free to pause the video as well if I'm going too quickly for you. I think we're building out a bit of the uh, beak over here at this phase. Let me give you a good top-down view. And a little bit of an oblique view from the back here. All right, next phase, this block slice here. We have some torches up here, I think, to represent uh, the eyes of the eagle, kind of. I suppose you could put some buttons there. I did try to put some more detail into the face, but everything I tried just looked ridiculous. So I left it off. Sometimes you have to know when building 
uh, when to stop because you can sometimes be adding too much detail for detail's sake and your build will be just encrusted by various things. I think uh, we have a split in the design up here. We have uh, these blocks here on both sides. They are now dividing for the wings over here as well. Those blocks there. Of course, both wings here are symmetrical. And two blocks there. And uh, three blocks here. And then I think one more block up here. And with that, your Imperial Roman Eagle statue will be complete. And let me give you a good, long, slow view here from the sides and from the back. And of course, both sides are the same, so I'll give you one last view here from the front. So I hope you enjoyed the Roman Eagle tutorial. This is sort of an addenda tutorial to the Roman Lighthouse that I put out yesterday. But I wanted to separate this out into its own short video because I think some of you will only want to construct the eagle and would like a dedicated tutorial for the sculpture itself apart from the rest of the building. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time.